For lifelong coaches like Stan Winky, football always seems to come back around. He'll joke with you, Marley, that <laughs> he's retired several times. He's said it more than a few times in his life. And there's nothing wrong with that. Football is a part of Stan Winky. He's back on the sideline tonight in his first game as the Georgetown Ridge Farm head coach. The Buffs hosting Oakwood. Not a lot of luck for the Buffs tonight, though. Brevin Wells launches one downfield for Brady Howard for the big gain. Then Wells finds... Griffin Tress for the touchdown. Pretty play there off the corner shoulder. GRF trying to get anything going. Logan Dawson picked, though, by Matthew Miller here. This one belonged to Oakwood. 66-14. They're a good road win. Also in the Vermilion Valley Conference, Bismarck heading Rossville Alvin rolls out the welcome mats for Westville. And catch of the night here as Dawson Dodd looking for Ooh. Eric Watson who tips it and makes the one-handed grab. Next play, Dodd finds Mason Hackman for one of his two scores. Ooh, that's a gorgeous Ooh, nice play. Nice drag in the feet. Yeah. <laughs> and then Westville trying to come back, but Brody Sexton picks up the fumble and goes 83 yards for the score. BHRA gets the blowout win, 48 to 7. What was better, the catch or the haircut? Oh, the haircut, okay. for sure. <laughs> Moreau Forsyth beat BHRA last week. The Trojans back at home, welcoming Athens to town. It'll be Ben Gilbert for a couple yards. Then Bryson Bowes goes for a running touchdown on this next one here. And then it'll be Deson Davis. He'll respond with a touchdown for Athens. But after that, it's all Moreau Forsyth as Ben Gilbert gets it. On the board, it'll be 56-12, Maroa over Athens. MacArthur goes for back-to-back -back wins. The Generals visiting Sacred Heart Griffin, but a tough task tonight against the Cyclones. Generals trying to work their way down the field to put some points on the board before the half. Quarterback Brylan Phillips completing two short passes, but the night belongs to SHG. They are so good for a reason. They were down 34-0 at half. MacArthur was. Start of the second, the MacArthur fumble. That leads to a touchdown run from running back Alex Sweet. Wheatland, 54-0, SHG all over Mac tonight in a big-time shutout. And our last prep visual stop takes, up, takes us to Chatham for Glenwood and Jacksonville. The CS8, Jacksonville started off hot with quarterback Elijah Owens running it into the five-yard line, and then here he goes, taking it all the way in to put Jacksonville up 7-0. From there, though, it was all Glenwood with quarterback Jake Barris finding his man all the way down the field to put the Titans in the red zone. He threw for three touchdowns and added two more on the ground. Then he hits wide receiver Austin Bush for a touchdown, 286 yards through the air for him. Glenwood defends home field. It'll be 35-14. That's 11 high school football games down. We've got three more Illini to come with more awards for Iowa.